God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. When the King shall come again, all his power revealing, splendor shall announce his reign, life and joy and healing, earth no longer in decay, hope no more frustrated. This is God's redemption day, longingly awaited. In the desert trees take root, fresh from God's creation. Plants and flowers and sweetest fruit join the celebration. Rivers spring up from the earth, barren lands adorning. Valleys, this is your new birth, mountains greet the morning. There God's highway shall be seen, when a roaring lion, nothing evil or unclean, walks the road to Zion, ransomed people homeward bound, all your praises voicing, see your Lord in glory crown, share in his rejoicing. Rejoice, Jerusalem, let your joy overflow. Your Savior will come to you. Alleluia. Praise, O servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. May the name of the Lord be blessed, both now and forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its setting, praised be the name of the Lord. High above all nations is the Lord, above the heavens his glory. Who is like the Lord our God, who has risen on high to his throne? yet stoops from the heights to look down, to look down upon heaven and earth. From the dust he lifts up the lowly, from his misery he raises the poor, to set him in the company of princes, yes, with the princes of his people. To the childless wife he gives a home, and gladdens her heart with children. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Rejoice, Jerusalem. Let, Let your, your joy, joy overflow. Your, your Savior will come to you. Alleluia. I, the Lord, am coming to save you. Already I am near. Soon I will free you from your sins. I trusted, even when I said, I am sorely afflicted. And when I said in my alarm, no man can be trusted. How can I repay the Lord for his goodness to me? The cup of salvation I will raise. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people. O precious in the eyes of the Lord is the death of his faithful. Your servant, Lord, your servant am I. You have loosened my bonds. A thanksgiving sacrifice I make. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people in the courts of the house of the Lord, in your midst, O Jerusalem. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. I, the Lord, am, am coming, coming to save you. Already, already I am near. Soon I will free you from your sins. Lord, send the Lamb, the ruler of the earth, from the rock in the desert to the mountain of the daughter of Zion. Though he was in the form of God, Jesus did not deem equality with God something to be grasped at. Rather, he emptied himself and took the form of a slave, 
being born in the likeness of men. He was known to be of human estate, and it was thus that he humbled himself, obediently accepting even death, death on a cross. Because of this, God highly exalted him and bestowed on him the name above every other name, so that at Jesus' name every knee must bend in the heavens, on the earth, and under the earth, and every tongue proclaim to the glory of God the Father, Jesus Christ is Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, send the Lamb, the ruler of the earth, from the rock in the desert to the mountain of the daughter of Zion. May the God of peace make you perfect in holiness. May he preserve you whole and entire, spirit, soul, and body, irreproachable at the coming of the Lord Jesus Christ. He who calls us is trustworthy, therefore he will do it. Lord, show us your mercy and love. Lord, show us your mercy and love. And grant us your salvation. Your mercy and love. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Lord, show us your mercy and love. There was no God before me, and after me there will be none. Every knee shall bend in worship, and every tongue shall praise me. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. There was no God before me, and, and after me there will be none. Every knee shall bend in worship, and every tongue shall praise me. Jesus Christ is the joy and happiness of all who look forward to his coming. Let us call upon him and say, Come, Lord, and do not delay. In joy we wait for your coming. Come, Lord Jesus. Come, Lord, and do not delay. Before time began, you shared life with the Father. Come now and save us. Come, Lord, and do not delay. You created the world and all who live in it. Come to redeem the work of your hands. Come, Lord, and do not delay. You did not hesitate to become man, subject to death. Come to free us from the power of death. Come, Lord, and do not delay. You came to give us life to the full. Come and give us your unending life. Come, Lord, and do not delay. You desire all people to live in love in your kingdom. Come and bring together those who long to see you face to face. Come, Lord, and do not delay. Our Father, who, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. 
Lord God, may we, your people, who look forward to the birthday of Christ, experience the joy of salvation and celebrate that feast with love and thanksgiving. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.